East End and breathtaking beautiful wanted nature. What do you know about New Zealand? Apart from the fact it's located near Australia and English house spoken deer. Let's see what is special about this country and who is so incredible. New Zealand was first discovered to the world by Dutch navigator Abel Tasman in 1642, when the new land has beat by Maori tribes, who rebuffed the Dutchman, after which Abel treat and returned to Holland. After that his land was named New Zealand, the honor of a small province in Holland, Zealand. But will now New Zealand as former British colony? What does the Dutch have to do with it? That's right, the next visit to New Zealand was made by British explorer Jason Cook in 1769, since the New Zealand was been part of British Empire until independence. The Maori people, now the New Zealand tattoo, still live in New Zealand. The population of country is 5 million people, but their one land they considered a minority. Despite this, Maori have ended contributed in New Zealand national sport, rugby. The fact is that the New Zealand national rugby team Al Blacks performed a traditional intimidating Maori dance haka at the beginning each game. Thanks to original and fascinating appearance, the national team has become one of the most popular teams in the world. They saved the big hackers. The modern population of New Zealand consists mainly of immigrants from European countries and United States. And today this country attracts immigrants from all over the world. Currently the flow of migrants from China and India prevails. Even despite its remoteness, New Zealand is one of the fastening growing economics and modern countries in the world. In terms of level and quality of life, New Zealand is even a hit of Australia and catching up with Germany. Wellington Wellington is the capital of New Zealand and the most picture cities. It's located the south coast of the North Island. Surrounded by green hills, Wellington is also known for architecture uniqueness. The city is famous for its numerous building built in style of colonial architecture mixture with modern elements. The city activity supports various culture events and festivals attracting people from all over the world. But although Wellington is the capital, it's not the largest city. Auckland Located on North Island is the economic center of the country, largely focused on transport, trade and finance. It's a dynamic and energetic city offering residents and visitors a world of experience and many opportunities for research. Both cities have their advantages and peculiarities, and the choice between Wellington and Auckland might depend on lifestyle, professional opportunities and environmental preferences. New Zealand is a unique country with diverse and fascinating nature. In landscapes may resemble many water plays, but in some time have their one unique beauty. The mountains, fjords, snuggle red peaks and crystal clear lakes create a stirring landscape. Also, an integral part of New Zealand nature are the pictures and diverse beaches that are located throughout the country. One of the most beautiful beaches is considered to be Wawariki Beach. Located away from the main attraction, there are always few tourists here. When this place, you'll feel atmosphere of privacy and freedom. Wait, stop! Does this remind you anything? And now? This is the place that you can't see of the official Microsoft Windows 10 wallpaper. But this is far from the limit where the nation of New Zealand was shown. Due to its nation, New Zealand was chosen at a film location for the legendary Lord of Rings trilogy and later the Hobbit trilogy. The builds, landscapes and locations suitable for the meaning created one large film set. Thanks to incredible views of mountains, lakes, forests, waterfield, cliffs and plains, that were included in a film, these two trilogies became one of the most beautiful and highest grossing film in a dirt time.
after the release of the first three films and gained worldwide popularity and at the same time in New Zealand gained worldwide popularity among tourists. As a rule, vacationers and New Zealand travel around the country by car, though New Zealand's stunning views agree the extent. One of the most recognizable New Zealand attractions associated with the trilogy is a Hobbiton, a real decorative complex created specifically for the filming of the Lord of Rings and the Hobbit. The spirit of the trilogy is filled here more than anywhere else. But the nature of New Zealand not only makes one a shot at its also inspires. A perfect example of this is director James Cameron, who borrowed the several elements of New Zealand nature to create an image of a fascinating plain Pandora or the Avatar franchise. One of these elements is Cave of Luminous Mosquitoes Y motto that inspired the director to create the so called So Seeds for this film. The second avatar, The Way of Water, which came out with any two, was also not a period of a piece of New Zealand. And while we're talking about the second film, it's impossible not to mention the Medca in a water type which was featured in this part of the franchise, made kind of tribe when inspired by image of an affirmation of our people from New Zealand. The main filming process of both films also took place in this country. Wellington is a home to world's largest visual effects studio, Weta Digital, owned by director Peter Jackson to film the same Lord of Rings and a Hobbit. Everything in this world is interconnected, and the interweaving can be even in such a remote place as New Zealand. Now I invite you to visually immerse yourself and the wonderful nature of this wonderful country.